From Madison Square Garden, it's the Global Community Cup at Nike World Basketball Festival. The USA versus France, and France looking good early. This is Boris Diaw drilling the three. He led France with 15. The USA's lead a slim margin, just two points at that point later. Lamar Odom passes to Rudy Gay, and Rudy Gay hammers that one home. Off the bench, he led everyone with 19 points. The U.S. up by a half dozen. Check the hustle here from Andre Iguodala. He only scored two points on the day, but they were spectacular. Good effort on defense. Leads to the productivity on offense. USA's lead eight at that point. Later in the second quarter, it's Rajon Rondo finding Kevin Durant. Kevin Durant finding the rim in a hurry. He started off 0 of 5, but finished the game 5 of 11. Still second quarter, Rondo doing it on his own this time. He had six points and a team high six assists. Fancy on this one for the fans at MSG. Rondo getting it done. The USA up by nine. Then Rondo sharing outside to Chauncey Billups, who was draining threes. He was three of six from range. You saw one. Here is another. If you don't guard it, he's going to pull. Billups nails that with the USA. Starting to extend that margin. They're up by 13 in the third. Still 13. There goes Rondo one more time. Nobody stops him. He takes advantage. U.S. up by 15, 49 to 34. Fourth quarter, more of the same. This time it's Derrick Rose sharing again with Rudy Gay, who's displaying a little athleticism there. He had a terrific game, 19 points. The USA wins by 31, but one man stood alone as the player of the game. Congratulations, Chauncey, for being today's Tiffany & Company player of the game.